Today in this video, I will show you how to add Grammarly to Microsoft Word for free and how it works. First, I want to tell you about some of the importance of using Grammarly. Grammarly's writing app makes sure everything you type is not only correct, but also clear and easy to read. The free version is a useful tool and better than not having a second set of eyes look over your writing. It will identify far more spelling and grammar mistakes than your typical free checker. Open your internet browser. Type Grammarly. If you already have an account on Grammarly, then you have to log in. I will click on sign up to show you how to sign up. Click on sign up. You can sign up with your Facebook account or Google account or Apple account. I will sign up with my Google account. They are asking most of your work will be for school, work, or other projects. Choose any one of the options. Click continue. They are asking you want help in spelling and grammar, sounding fluent, clear communication, plagiarism, synonyms, tone, and delivery, conciseness, or other. Choose any one of the options. Choose any one of the options. Click on Continue. Click on Continue to Grammarly, it's free. Click on Skip the Tour. Click on the three line button. Click on Grammarly. This is my Grammarly account. Click on Apps. You can see Grammarly for Microsoft Office. We have to install it. Click on Install. Click on the Save File. You can see the installation started. Click on the Download button. Open the folder. This is Grammarly setup. Open it. Click on Get Started. Grammarly for Microsoft Word and Grammarly for Outlook both are selected. Click on Install. Wait while it's installing. Now the installation has been completed. Let's open Microsoft Word and see how it works. Open Microsoft Word document. This is the Grammarly button installed in Microsoft Word. Now, we can easily find grammar mistakes with the help of Grammarly, and it's free to use. Now I will show you how it works. Open Word document with text inside. This is the summary document. I have written a summary. I will check grammar mistakes in this document. Click on the Open Grammarly button. Now you have to log into your Grammarly account. You have to sign in. I have signed into my Gmail account. Now it's working. You can see the mistakes in this document are highlighted. I will correct them one by one by clicking on the underlined word. Follow these steps to correct the mistakes. I'm done with correcting the mistakes in this document. If you want to correct this document more, then you can buy a premium from the website. Here I want to suggest you that don't buy this software from people who sell it online. Instead always buy such softwares from the official website. After correcting save the document.
This is how I generally use Grammarly. I found it seamless to install. And it's extremely intuitive to use. However, note that you do need to be connected to the internet while using it in Microsoft Word.